of Barbados. Second semi-final, under 20 boys, 800 meters. The Jamaican held his hand up at the last minute, and now there is a recall. You know, I said it. Yashin Bowen put in a tremendous last 100 meters to snatch second at the Karifta trials. Barely made his way onto the plane. Now, I made the point yesterday that once you go into that set position, you're not allowed to do that. But remember, yesterday it was done in the 400 meters. And the athlete was given a warning and allowed to continue. So it's going to be a green card in line with consistency. Consistent application of discretion. Second semi-final for the under-20 boys, 800 meters. Kamaria Bygrave of Jamaica and Zion Miller of the Bahamas already automatically the into the final. Away they go for the second semi-final. Langley, U.S. Virgin Islands, Bowen, Jamaica, Brown, Grenada, Lynch, British Virgin Islands, Woodley of Trinidad and Tobago, and Morris of Barbados. Aaron Morris of Barbados joins Bowen of Jamaica. Bowen wants to be at the front, and so he steps up the pace ever so slightly, gets himself in comfortable running position, with the Barbadian sitting in second position. Trinidad and Tobago's Jaffa Woodley looks real solid here. He comes up on the outside and will have the lead at the bell. Maybe Bowen doesn't want to let him go. Bowen trapped on the inside and just pushing the Trent Begonian further wide on the outside of lane number one with the Barbadian Aaron Morris right there as well. Grenada's D'Angelo Brown not out of it and steps forward into the mix. Only two short to be in the final. Semi-final two of the under 20 boys, 800 meters. Bowen up Jamaica. Trinidad and Tobago's Jaffa Woodley right there with him. The Barbadian, Aaron Morris in third. Grenada's D'Angelo Brown in fourth. Trinidad and Tobago's Jaffa Woodley take charge. The Barbadian running brilliantly as well, Aaron Morris. Bowen up Jamaica, still holding strong, looking around left, looking around right. Only two short to be in to the final. It's Jaffa Woodley of Trinidad and Tobago ahead of Yashin Bowen of Jamaica. Those two are safe. Strong charge by D'Angelo Brown, 1500 meter fifth place last night. Thumbs up, 154.92. That's faster than we got in the first semi final. So, a pretty nippy semi final here as the Trinidad and Tobago athlete storms to a personal best in qualifying and confirms his place in the final. Here's another look at the last 120. Woodley of Trinidad and Tobago, Bowen of Jamaica. A little bit of separation up at the front. And you can see Bowen looks comfortable. He knows uh, what's coming. He can see Brown making that charge and knows that he just needs to be in the top two to advance uh, to the final of uh, this event. Here's confirmation. 154.92 for Woodley, 155.32 for Bowen. D'Angelo Brown, 155.47. Knocks out Jamal Sullivan of uh, Guyana. And Morris, 155.69, does so as well. 
And both by a split second. He was on 155.7.